the WWE Intercontinental title on the line. Perhaps a new chapter will be written in this championship's long history. For over 40 years, the WWE's best have competed for this title. Winning the Intercontinental title has been a major milestone in some Hall of Fame careers, and well, it could be just that again here tonight. Ooh, a little with the kick. And he's not done now. Looking for the submission. Here it is. It's the bro mission, Corey. After everything these two men have been through, will it end like this? Will it end with a submission? Trying to find a way out. Several right hands, and he's out. Nice series of strikes. Combo finds the mark. Riddle has him up. Oh, bro, Derek. Gonna see a new champ. Two. He manages to kick out. What strength. The title still hanging in the balance. Resilience of a champion on display. From the top, Senton. He's got the target acquired. Just a matter of moments. Oh, straight forearm. This is gonna hurt. Doomsday Saito. Oh, what power. Lifted him up high. Tombstone pile driver. Another one bites the double under hook. Up and down brain buster. Now that is why they're the champ. And the champ stands tall once again. Get ready for the world premiere of Elias's brand new song. Hello, I am Elias, and I am the man who... Where did he come from? I don't know, but thank you. These two had an issue on social media about this song. That must be what this is all about. You want to write stupid songs about me, huh? This is what happens. No one's ever going to hear it now. I'm shutting you up for good. You're never going to sing again. <laughs> it's one thing to take issue with a song lyric, but that crossed the line. I agree, Michael. Maybe you're right, but hey, at least we didn't have to hear Elias sing. Yeah, we might not again for quite some time. The voice of SmackDown may have been temporarily silenced, but Elias won't go down quietly as he takes on the superstar responsible for the ruthless attack. Whoa, the voice of SmackDown? I thought that was you, Michael. Very observant, Byron. Wait, is anybody actually upset that Elias can't sing right now? Elias' opponent should be considered a hero. Ooh, he's treading all over their opponent. He gets out of the way. Ooh! Honing in on the arm. Uh, here we go. Beautiful. Hoisted to the top. There is the Tower of London. Momentum is running away from Elias. And Elias needs to figure things out quick. Matt slam. Oh, what a forearm. Uh-oh. Northern Lions. Oh, not done yet. There's more. No way. What a combination, the brain buster. This is gonna hurt. Doomsday Saito. Oh, what power. Lifted him up high. Two stop. Hooks in. Up and down, brain buster. The opening is there for the taking. And this one is over.
Ever since Elias was first attacked on SmackDown, the war of words with his assailant has only intensified, all leading to tonight's no disqualification climax. I believe the musical term is a crescendo, Cole, and the volume will be turned up all the way as both superstars look to have the last word. If you ask me, Elias' opponent will be the one singing the blues after this encounter. Well, that's one way to leave the ring, I suppose. And he has free reign to the outside with no countouts to worry about. How did scouted? Counter after counter. Oh, and a wicked clothesline. Boom, head first. Rocked with the point of the elbow. Elias gets intercepted. Up and down with the Alabama slam. Through the. Oh my God, get out of the way! Get out of the way! This is gonna be good! That destructive act practically happened right in the laps. If you can't handle being this close to the carnage, Saxton, feel free to leave. This is what real ferocity looks like. Re enters under the ropes. And that seemed like a pretty easy day at the office right there. Never a doubt, barely a moment's suspense. This one was about as lopsided as they come.